Now, your exclusive Storm Team forecast from KTVO. Good evening, everyone. I got good news and I got bad news. This weather we've been having is going to stick around a little bit longer, but it should clear up within the next 24 to 48 hours. Here's some current temperatures for you. 18 in Bismarck, 26 in Denver, 52 in St. Louis, which I'll tell you why it's so warm there in a second. 43 in Kansas City and 36 in Des Moines. Coming closer to the heartland, you'll see we were in the 30s and the 40s currently as that system does make its way through. Currently in Kirksville, it's 45 degrees. Feels like 40 with winds out of the south at 9. Humidity still at 100% as that fog is going to stick around till about midnight. In Ottumwa, it is currently 36 degrees. Wind chill at 32. Winds out of the east, southeast at 5. Still got some fog going up in the city of Bridges. So again, that will move out. Here's what we expect today with the Heartland Satrad. A lot of this did come through, but we are now getting some rain and thunderstorms, especially south of Kirksville. We have two small cells, but those should move off. And then we have some cells north of Keokuk County, and those will also move off. But we do have some snow that will stick around till about noon time tomorrow. Overnight, this is what we're going to expect. Uh, rain, snow, fog mix, mostly cloudy, be about 27 degrees. Winds will be out of the south, southeast, 10 to 20 miles per hour. We could see some thunderstorms, which those cells I pointed out, but they should move out by what we can expect in the morning. Looking at the winds, you can see most of our winds were in the 20 to 30 mile per hour range throughout the day as that system does move through. So be careful if you are driving out there because those will probably stay with us for the next couple of hours. You can see future cast things should clear up by tomorrow afternoon around noontime, which is very good because we want to get those roads nice and clear. They are a little slick, but tomorrow morning by 7 a.m. 8 degrees, a little cloudy out there by 10 a.m. 13 degrees. We should should get some sunny skies, but we will have some light snow in parts of our viewing area. We'll be very breezy tomorrow afternoon, 36 degrees. Winds out of the west, 20 to 25 miles per hour. By tomorrow night, we should be at 25 degrees. That will be clear conditions as the systems do move out. Winds will be out between 5 and 10 miles per hour. This is why I want to focus on what's going on in southeast Missouri. They have tornado watches and warnings going on in the, the tri-state area down there, as you can see on the surface map. That should move out by tomorrow morning, but that's because we have a lot of cold air from the north and warm air from the Gulf coming together. This is very unusual for this time of year, but as you can see on our surface map, we have some snow over the Rocky Mountains that will move its way through, and then we have some rain over the Texas Panhandle and in Texas, and that will move its way out as well. Here's your five-day forecast. As you can see, 36 degrees tomorrow, 20 percent chance of snow, mostly in the morning hours, but that should move out on Tuesday through Friday. We should be into the 40s, and our overnight temperatures will be below freezing, so make sure you you do bring those pets indoors. As always, you can get your complete Storm Team 3 forecast at heartlandconnection.com.